So it's been a while since I've made a video like this. Um, it's the winter now, which is a little bit depressing because 6 o'clock when you get home from work, it's dark. Um, so this year I've decided for the winter especially to focus on my short game, in particular uh, my putting. My putting has improved massively since my, uh, I bought the new putter, which is great, but it just needs to come on a little bit more. So, and if you remember me mentioning in a previous video, this video, this DVD here, the video has no longer existed. Um, Phil Mickelson's Secret at the Short Game. Now, in there, there is a, it's a two-disc DVD with a book of hints and tips um, from Phil, which is all covered in the DVD. Uh, he does, in fact, use um, a putting tutor, uh, which is the one I bought, which is Dave Dave Pell's um, putting tutor. So here it is now. This is what I, what I bought. So you have the actual tutor itself, uh, which comes with two instruction manuals, one in English and one in French. Um, handy if you know French. Uh, also, um, some elasticated wire to go from point to point and the uh, magnetic balls or the, the ball bearings. So how it works, um, just to give you a little quick demonstration, is try and put it sort of flat-ish. So you put your ball and you put your ball on in the hole at the end. Uh, this one's quite handy because it has a line pre-drawn on it and then you take your ball bearings and you take two of them and you put them like so now the idea is you put the ball along the line through the gate um, working from the outside to making the gate smaller and smaller again um, let me just refer to this because this gives them what the so they go from standard which is the biggest to pro to tour pro now the idea obviously is to get from the, the outer spots putting through get nice and clear going through to the middle and then working your way to the inner so when you can get to step up to the putt it doesn't matter what size the gate is you're just going to hit that ball down the line through now if you hit the ball off to the side, it catches the ball bearing, the ball bearing does fall out. Now that's quite good because it shows you exactly where you're missing, um, where you're, you're, you're turning your hands, your, your swing path. Um, what I'm going to do is set this line up from um, behind the hole, or behind where I'm standing, straight over the line and then put it uh, either over the hole or along the line of the putt. Um, so the idea is, like in this diagram here, you're going to try and go along along the line, and then the ball's going to break, but you're still going to try and putt along this line to get to have a nice smooth stroke. Um, it's going to take a bit of time to get used to, but I think if I can continue working with this, um, I've brought it home with me, so it's no longer it's not in my bag. Um, I'm going to keep practicing with this and I hope that's not going well. Hopefully, um, when by the time the winter's up, my, my putting, or even during the winter, my putting improves massively and um, I become a better putter because of it and a better golfer in general. Oh, I might, luckily I found all them. So put them back in there. Put the lid on without spilling everywhere. And then back in the handy little bag. Now obviously this bag is great because it can go into your golf bag. And like that. They can go in there as well. I think I'll do away with the French instructions. Um, and then yeah. Zip it up. Jobs are good in. Um, next little bit of this video is just going to be a case of... Um, Going to the course, hitting a few putts, and you know, just just trying it out really. Um, let's see how it goes. Thanks for watching.
a right to left break on that. Not massive. On the middle setting. Boom. Um. 